What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, to my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Pisces, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. This is uh, week two reading for sign of Pisces. This could resonate if you have Pisces in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Midheaven, or Jupiter charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. This is a free general reading, so it's very important to only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Way too many. Um, so I got a channel in as I was meditating on your energy. I felt guided to do Pisces. Um, and then I got a channel, so it was confirmation to do it. So the channel I received was, excuse me, important, significant communication is about to come in soon. Um, some from, um, oh, some from uh, a news station, some from, um, some from an online submission report, um, some from an angry Scorpio, and some from an angry Taurus, and some regarding a lawsuit of a um, religious organization. So that's a lot of communication. You have to plug yourself in wherever you fit. If you do fit, that's a lot of communication. So, you know, it's a free general reading. So you have to plug yourself in where you fit. But communication coming in. Some of you guys, it sounds like it's coming to you, Pisces. Some from a news station or stations. Some from um, an angry Torrin. Some from an angry Scorpio. Some from... Um, they can have Taurus or Scorpio in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Menhem, or Jupiter charts. Masculine or Feminine, Taurus or Scorpio. Some from um, a submission from an online report. So one of you guys already has or is about to file an online report of some shape, form, or fashion. And you're about to get communication regarding that. So I think that might be like a confirmation number or submission number or confirmation email or text that you have submitted the report in some shape, form, or fashion. I don't feel that's like verbal communication or face-to-face, -face, that one. And um, some from uh, regarding a lawsuit um, of a religious organization. Now, um, you have to plug that in how that resonates. I, you might be filing a lawsuit against a religious organization or, or religious organization is filing a lawsuit against you or or you are connected to this lawsuit in some shape, form or fashion, um, like on the outskirts looking in um, of this lawsuit of this religious organization. Um, you have to plug that, that in how that resonates in your life um, if it does resonate for you. Um, just saying. Okay. And one particular Pisces reader is about to receive a very large donation. Very, very, very well deserved. Gifted. Okay. So you play truly gifted, not a fraud. Okay. Wow. Okay. So you plug it in how it resonates. And for one of you guys, um, you're about to, you are a Pisces gifted reader, truly gifted, not a fraud, whoever you are. You could be masculine or femme Pisces. You could have Pisces in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or femme, midheaven, or Jupiter. But you're truly gifted and not a fraud that was specific from the spiritual realm. And I heard you're about to receive a very, very, very large donation because you truly deserve it. So congrats to the Pisces truly gifted um, reader, not a fraud energy. Just saying. Um, I feel you have the clairs. I feel you have the clairs. Clair audience, clairvoyance, clairsentience, psychic medium abilities, or dreamscape abilities. Um, congrats to you. Two of Pentacles upright, Nine of Cups reversed. A particular Pisces is really, really, really struggling with addictions. Very, very hard. 
Some of these Pisces have access to addicted sub substances in their workplace. One is probably going to slip up very soon. And then series of chain of events will occur. Oh my God. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, oh, now if this isn't you, it could be somebody you're connected to. So you have to plug yourself in where you fit if you do fit. But there's one Pisces out in the universe that's apparently really struggling with addictions. So they have a history of addictions um, in some shape, form, or fashion. But they, whoever this is, they're in an employment situation right now. And um, I heard they probably will slip. Um, they have access to some kind of addictive sub substances in their workplace. Now, to me, that could be alcohol or that could be drugs. Um, you, I, I think like bar type energy or I think healthcare type energy. Um, I think drugs or alcohol is what I think. Um, or it could be um, sex addictions and um, you work in a bar and you get hit on all the time. Or you work in a place where people hit on you all the time. Um, or you're connected to prostitutes in some shape, form, or fashion if it's drugs, I mean, if it's sex you're addicted to. Because um, addictions can span many different ways. Drugs, alcohols, gambling, sex, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So whatever addictive sub substances, if this resonates for you or somebody you're connected to, that you are addicted to, but it sounds like you've stopped it, but you have access to it in your workplace in some shape, form, or fashion. I heard one of these Pisces is probably going to slip up soon and give in to their addictions. So whatever it is, uh, because they have access to it in their workplace environment. So, oh my goodness. So two pinnacles upright is juggling. I, I think in this aspect is juggling um, this Pi particular Pisces, juggling the idea of going back to their addictive habits, whether it's drugs, alcohol, sex, um, gambling, et cetera, et cetera. And then nine of cups reverse, they've stopped the addictive um habit whatever it is it can be one or two plus things but they are um around it in their workplace environment and one of them will probably slip up soon and go back to it um however that resonates like i said i think bar energy i think um i think bar energy or nightclub energy or healthcare environment energy or something of that nature Spare messages you have some Pisces. Spare messages you have some Pisces. A particular Pisces is about to pull up their money and move very, very, very soon. Get out of a very toxic home and environment. Will be one of the best decisions they ever made. Some they have people dependent on them, some they do not. So you plug it in, how that, how that resonates, if that resonates for you, Pisces. Um, um, that's a good one. So whoever that's for, I heard you're about to pull up your money, pull up your money soon. So save up your money. It sounds like you've already been saving up your money. Saving up your money, saving up um, your resources, i.e. your financial money, your financial resources. And you're about to move locations um and i heard basically it's going to be the best thing to ever happen to you it's some kind of toxic environment that you're currently in some you have people dependent on you so i think you take care of other people it could be children of yours or children or children you're connected to or just people that are you're connected to it don't have to be children just people you're connected to or children of yours or what have you but people that depend on you for some and some it's just you but it's some kind of toxic home environment you're currently in. Now, we've had a lot, a lot, a lot of hidden camera energy popping up in the universal space um, in the spiritual realm. There's been two readers that I know of within the last couple days personally that have found hidden cameras or speakers or something of that nature currently in their home environment. So I automatically think when I hear toxic home environment, I think hidden camera energy. I think illegal speaker energy. I think something that is invading your privacy um, that's making it toxic for you is what I'm feeling. Or it could be something else that makes it toxic for you in your home environment. But I heard it's going to be the best decision you ever made. And um, 
so kudos to you, whoever this is for. Um, nobody, sh nobody should have to um, live in that kind of situation. Period. Ten of Cups upright, Six of Wands reversed. A particular Pisces feminine is about to find a hidden camera in her home. She's about to tell a co-worker about this. The co-worker has alerted her to check her home. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So much hidden camera energy in the universe. This is terrible. Okay, so if this resonates, that particular message resonates with you, you're a Pisces femme. You could have Pisces in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or femme, and Henry Jupiter charts. But if that resonates with you, I heard a co-worker has alerted you to basically check your home for hidden cameras. Um, and it sounds like you're about to. And then when you check your home for whoever this is for, you haven't found the hidden camera yet, but it sounds like you're about to. But once, um, and a co-worker has alerted you in some shape, form, or fashion to check your home. So, you know, just to make sure there's nothing in there. Just to be safe kind of energy. And absolutely, I encourage everybody to do that. Absolutely. Um, some people have been successful finding them in their homes. Some have not. Some, I mean, you plug it in how it resonates. But whoever this is for, you're about to find. You're about to listen to the advice. You're about to take action. And I heard you're about to find the camera. So you go with your bad self, whoever that's for. Um, whoever that is for. It's going to lead to many series of chain events. Lots of action. Okay, I heard it's going to lead to many series of chain events. Lots of action. So, whoever this is for, you haven't found the hidden camera yet, but you're about to. Um, I just want to let everybody know, there's an app called Hidden Camera Detector. That is the app that Unique and Unapologetic Tara used and Spiritual Advisor LLC used that found the speaker. And the hidden cameras in um, the speaker in um, Spiritual Advisor LLC's home. And the hidden cameras in Unique and Unapologetic Tara's home. So just let it right now. Um, hidden Camera Detector, it's an app. I'm about to, I think I might download it tonight. Um, possibly. Um, so just let everybody know, okay? But you haven't found the hidden camera yet. Whoever that's for, you're about to. Um Kudos to you. I heard it's going to lead to many series of chain events and lots of action. So that might be lawsuit energy. That might be communication of thanking the coworker. That I mean, that really could resonate in a million different ways for a million different people. But um, I believe as a collective, we y'all know I've been combating the freaking hidden camera energy on here since March of freaking 2020. I'm glad people are finding this crap. So I, I, some have found them and some have not. But whoever this is for, you're about to find it. Ten of Cups upright, Six of Wands reversed. A particular Pisces is about to file a lawsuit on another Pisces soon, after many series of chain of events. And give her information to a feminine fire sign. Oh my God. Okay, I heard a particular Pisces is about to file a lawsuit on a fem, um, fem Pisces to fem Pisces, fem fire sign. Oh my God. Okay, wow. So it's a fem Pisces about to file a lawsuit on another fem Pisces. Um, they could, Those two fem Pisces, you could be the fem Pisces about to file a lawsuit on the other fem Pisces, or you could be the Pisces about to get the lawsuit filed on you against the other fem Pisces. How that resonates. Or you could be the fem fire sign. How that resonates, um, but we're in Pisces reading. But you plug it in how it resonates. But two Pisces, Fem Piscean energies. Um, one's about to file a lawsuit on another one. They could have Pisces in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Fem, and Haven, Jupiter charts. It sounds like series of chain of events is going to spur this lawsuit energy. And then not only is this Fem Pisces going to file a lawsuit on the other Fem Pisces, but they're going to, it sounds like the ones that's the one that's about to file a lawsuit on the other Fem Pisces, but they're going to deliver information to a Fem fire sign as well. Um, it, that could be an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius Fem energy. They could have Aries, Leo, or Sag in the Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Fem, Midham, or Jupiter. 
You plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates for you. Oh my goodness. Ten of Cups upright, Six of Wands reversed. Our particular Pisces is about to deliver a wonderful Christmas to their family. Wonderful Christmas. They have been staying out of BS from other people, protecting their energy and their money. Bikes. Video games. Electronics. Okay, so this is a good one. So you plug it in however that resonates. Um, if this resonates for you, your Piscean energy. I heard you've been staying out of basically drama and BS from other people and protecting your energy. So you've been protecting your energy. You haven't allowed other people to get into your mental space or physical space um, that you have not allowed to be there. Um, and I feel that's more on a personal level. If some, it could be co-working energy, but you know, when you're co-workers, you have to interact with them. It's just all in how you interact with them, basically. Um, but whoever this is for, you've been protecting your energy from people you don't want around you in your space, basically, is what I'm taking from that. Whether it's personal, professional, business, whatever it is, you have really been protecting your energy, um, protecting yourself mentally, physically, financially, I heard protecting your money and protecting your energy. And it sounds like it's about to pay off because you're about to give your family a wonderful Christmas. Um, so I heard bikes, electronics, and video game energy. So um, I think that might be what you're about to, um, you either already bought these for your family or you're about to. You plug it in, however that resonates. Um, that's really beautiful energy. That's gonna make your family very happy. Now, like I said, it could be children of yours or other people's children or people that you take care of or just other people that you want to give a good Christmas to in your family in some shape, form, or fashion. So make it, this is Ten of Cups Upright, happy family energy. It's been making your family happy that you've been protecting your money and your energy and basically not allowing other people to come in and manipulate you for money and manipulate, manipulate your energy and your time and you've really been focusing and six of wands reverse is like um no action as far as allowing other people to come in and manipulate you for money energy etc etc and it's been benefiting your family in a very positive way or it's about to benefit your family in a very positive way however that resonates that's really awesome you plug it in how it resonates okay let's get an oracle card and then i'm gonna close it Spirit messages you have some Pisces. Referral energy. Okay, I just heard referral energy. So you plug that in, how that resonates. I heard referral energy. So, um, well, we all know what a referral is, um, but I feel that's all I heard. So maybe somebody's about to refer you for something, or you're about to refer somebody else for something, but some kind of referral energy in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, referring is basically, you know, it's like refer a friend energy. Um, whoever this is, I feel it's true referral. You know, it's not lies and slander and craziness. It's true altruistic referral energy. You truly, either this person, if you are the one about to be referred, they truly think you are a very strong candidate for whatever they're about to refer you for. Or if you're referring somebody, 
you feel they're a very strong candidate for whatever they're, you're about to refer them for. So you plug it in, however that resonates. If that resonates for you, I'm sorry, I got the wrong deck. Wrong deck. Yep. A particular Pisces is about to get a phone call from a doctor's office soon for a particular procedure coming up. They really want done. It's going to make them very, very, very happy. Okay, so you plug it in, how that resonates. Well, that's awesome. Um, whoever that's for, I heard you're about to receive a phone call from a particular doctor's office for a procedure that you really have been wanting done. Um, and um, it's going to make you very happy. So um, whoever this that particular message is for, it's some kind of procedure in some shape, form, or fashion that you've been wanting done. Now, that could really re resonate in a million different ways for many different people. Um, it can be whatever it is. It's some kind of something involving something that a doctor has to perform on you, some kind of service, uh, some shape, form, or fashion that you want done, you've been wanting done, um, but it sounds like it's about the cycles are about to start moving with it soon. Um, it's maybe for some, it's, they have been stagnant. Maybe you've been waiting on insurance information to go through or an appointment time to um, open up or something of that nature. But it sounds like the wheel is about to start moving in that aspect and cycles are going to start moving in your favor with that aspect. Whatever it is you want done, it sounds like something on your body. Um, whether it's internally or externally or what have you. Okay, number 28 or 24 could be very significant numbers in somebody's life, possibly. It could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Be, could be a possible date of birth number, possible social security number, possible green card number, possible lottery number, possible jersey, jersey number, or any kind of significant number, reoccurring numbers you're seeing out in um, public, like on Advertisements are billboards, 24 and 28. Transcending. A particular Pisces is really going through a huge transformation. Huge. Internally and spiritually. It's about to pay off for them in a huge way. Light side Pisces. Well, that's beautiful, whoever this is for. Um, you're a light side Pisces. You could be masculine or feminine, but I heard you're basically uh, going through a huge internal transformation inside yourself. So like awakening energy, I heard um, internally and spiritually. So you're transforming in a positive way spiritually. Now, you know, you can be religious and spiritual or just spiritual. However that resonates for you, I don't judge anybody. Just saying, just saying. Um, so however that plugs in your life, but you I heard you are a light side Pisces, whether you're religious and spiritual or just spiritual, you are a light side Pisces. And, um, so you do not, you know, throw black magic people's way. You don't do nasty, shicey, crazy things to people. Um, you, you don't, you know, flatten people's tires or put sugar in people's gas tanks or, uh, rats and people's um, air filters or, you know, crazy shicey stuff. You live on the light side of life and you don't wish ill will or harm upon people, basically. And I heard basically you're going through a huge awakening and transformation and it's about to be very, very positive for you um, and going to benefit you in many ways. And congrats to you because I have went through several awakenings in my life, and especially through my spiritual journey. And um they're very necessary for growth. They're very, very necessary for growth. And um, so congrats, whoever that's for. Um, congrats. That's beautiful. So awakening energy is what I'm feeling from this. Awakening energy in a positive way. I heard you're a light side Pisces. Uh, we have been pulling, you know, there are some dark side Pisces I pull in from time to time. So uh, I, you obviously are on the light side. I just want to make that very abundantly clear. Whoever that's for. You're high vibrational. So you treat people with honesty, trust, respect, integrity, morals, values, etc. Protection. I 
A particular Pisces is about to file a very significant report soon. Some have already filed a report. Federal report. Some are about to file a police report. Oh my gosh, you plug it in how it resonates, my gosh. So if this resonates for you, um, some one of you guys, it sounds like, has already filed a federal report in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, that could be the confirmation energy at the beginning of the reading, possibly for some. Uh, for some, you're about to file a federal report. A federal report, um, and some you're about to file a police report. So that's local police report. So um, protection energy um, for you or somebody you're connected to, um, protecting yourself or somebody else. Uh, with these report energies, um, some it's federal report energy, some you've already filed the federal report, some you're about to file the federal report, some you're about to file a police report. Um, I did a reading in here earlier today, I got a channeling on somebody um, that just filed a federal trade commission report for identity theft, fraud, um, and secret seven situation, um, and money laundering. So um, that could be you or somebody you're connected to. Um, you plug it in, how that resonates, if that resonates for you. But I think you're about to help try to um, help protect you or somebody you're, uh, you care about in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, or both, however that resonates. That's beautiful energy, uh, whoever this is for. And one particular Pisces is very spiritually protected. They know this. And they're going to continu continue to be blessed in the universe by making smart decisions. Wow, so you plug it in how it resonates. That's beautiful. And one of you guys, I heard you're very spiritually protected. Um, you're gonna continue to be very blessed in the universe and spiritually protected basically um, by making very smart decisions. Um, so for one of you guys, this could be the reader energy um that you're about to receive the very large donation tarot card reader energy possibly or spiritualist energy however that resonates um spiritual protection here in this aspect um i feel for one that definitely is a spiritualist or tarot card reader very spiritually protected because you're making um smart decisions whoever you are and um if you're not that person you're just anybody that is um you're 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 protecting your spiritual health you're protecting your spiritual health and you're protecting yourself and you're very spiritually protected like i said whether you're religious or not um you're very spiritually protected you're making smart decisions this is you in this aspect spiritually protecting yourself um against harm and um black magic and all kinds of crazy crap that's out there basically A particular Pisces is about to find out about another Pisces Negli negligence of their children. Huge negligence of their children. This Pisces is about to step up and help protect these children. Sick of this. Oh my gosh. Whoa, so you plug it in how it resonates. So Pisces, the Pisces energy, whoever that message is for, you know of another Pisces that basically neglects their children in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, and you're about to basically step up and help protect the children um, because you know this other Pisces, um, they might be a dark side Pisces, possibly. It sounds like they are. Um, I didn't hear they were, but it sounds like they are. Because uh, I heard they, um, they, it sounds like it's not the first rodeo of neglecting these children. Um, it sounds like they probably have done it several times in the universe in several different occasions, but you know about this. You know about it, and you're about to step up and help protect the children. Um, so however you're about to help protect the children, you could have them come over to your house. You could call Child Protective Services. You could call the police. I mean, I, I don't. however that resonates in whoever's life. Everybody's on different time and life paths, but in this aspect, it's protection of children energy, if that resonates for you. Okay, and that could possibly be the police report energy too, maybe, possibly, I, 
possibly. You plug it in how it resonates. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, I didn't. I didn't. All right, you guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this. I love you guys so much, and everybody made wonderful choices, and namaste.